Welcome to the show. I am Ellen, and like many of you, I am a baby boomer. We are the generation that grew up drinking garden from garden hoses and drinking orange tang and drinking from our parents' liquor cabinet. <laughs> Baby boomers were born between 1946 and 1964. They call us that because after the uh, World War II, there was a boom of babies being born. People were like, we lived through the war, let's make whoopee. And <laughs> for you millennials, making whoopee is uh, like Netflix and chill. <laughs> But they were married. <laughs> That's <different. laughs> so, millennials were born between 1982 and 2004. These are people who will never know the joy of using an end of a pencil to dial the phone. Do you remember that? You would actually. <laughs> I have some news for baby boomers. We are not the majority anymore. A new census says that millennials have overtaken us, and I know this because a 20-year-old staff member read it to me from the internet. <laughs> so I want to uh, play a little game. I am going to test the knowledge between uh, baby boomers and millennials and see how well they know each other. Tracy Woods and Chantel Miller, where are you <laughs> All right, so I'm going to ask you questions about the other generation, and we'll see how well y'all know each other, OK? okay. All right, we're going to start with uh, the baby boomer. What does, and don't help anybody, because we want to see how much she knows. What okay. does YOLO mean? YOLO. What do you think it means? It's an icon right. on the text messaging. N no? Yeah. No? No? OK. No. All right. Um, hmm. You only live once. Oh, okay. YOLO. Yol yeah. I knew that. Yeah, I know you knew yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> You're just getting started. That's right. Yeah. All right, what is your name? Chantal. And you are Tracy. Tracy. All right. So, uh, Chantal, uh, name all four Beatles. Ooh. Uh, actually, um, Paul McCartney. Yep, that's one. <laughs> John Lennon? Yes. Really? Yes. Oh! Yes. I didn't know that. Yeah. Well, what, I, clearly I did. Yeah, you did. Um, Two others. Oh, my gosh. Ooh. No clue? Oh no, no, Michael. No, not Michael Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> but he did a song with Paul McCartney. He did Ebony and Ivory. Remember I, that? I do remember yeah. that. All right. Oh, my God. I don't think so. All right, so there was Ringo. Oh. And then there was George Harrison. Okay. I'll have to go. Oh. I'll go right. Yeah, they were a really good band. <laughs> they were. Yeah. They wrote a lot of songs. They were really, really good. Yeah, they were great. All right, Tracy, on Tinder, what would you do if you really, 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 really like someone? Mm, I send them a great picture of my face. <laughs> no, no, not it. Um, Tinder. Let me see. Do you know what Tinder um, is? Not really. <laughs> it's a dating app. Okay. Oh, okay. What would she do if she really, really, really? Super like, swipe yeah, up. Yeah, you can oh, only super okay. like, but you can only do it once every 24 hours or something. You That's have it? to. Okay. You can't like too many people. Oh, not too yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. Who can turn the world on with a smile? You can. Yes, I can. <laughs> you do. Come on, everybody, sing it with me. Who can turn the world on with a smile? See, I know the song. Yeah, all right. Mary Tyler Moore. Mary Tyler Moore. Yes, okay. All right. What show had the character Aunt B? Andy, Andy, I have pie, I have pie. <laughs> no, Andy Griffith Show, have you ever heard of that? Yes, yes. Wait, it's hard, it's hard to whistle. There was a, that's how, we were so patient, we would listen to a theme song that was a whistle. That's how, <laughs> yes, we, that's how we were. All right, and that's all, that's all. But you know what, you're gonna win something. You're gonna get a 55 inch TCL 4K Roku TV. Yeah!